Hi guys, this is App Unwrapper. I'm streaming the Westport Independent, which is coming to iOS and PC uh, in a few days later this week. I thought I would show you guys a preview. Maybe if enough people are watching, even let you uh, help me decide what decisions to make. It's basically a newspaper censorship game with multiple different endings uh, and choices you can make. So. I'll start a new game. I already played it twice. Uh, it's about an hour for a playthrough. I managed to get one of my in one of my games. I managed to get my paper closed down by being too rebellious, and I decided in my other game that I would be that I would go the kind of clickbait route. And I did a lot of celebrity articles and uh, pro, uh, you know pro government angles. So. I made the government happy, and that was my second ending. Um, so now I figure I'll try some other options, see where it goes, and maybe let you guys help me make decisions. So it's it takes place uh, over 12 weeks. And, uh, basically it's 12 weeks building up to, I'll let you listen to the messages in that story. Throughout this film, we'll answer various questions you may have regarding both preparations for the bill and the bill itself. What is the Public Culture Bill? The Public Culture Bill is a new bill that will come into force May 16, 1949, and has been created to improve the quality of independent media outlets. The bill contains seven guidelines for independent media outlets to follow that will make it easier to create media products of utmost quality. In order to make sure that everyone follows these guidelines, the bill will create a government-driven union called the Loyalist News and Media Association that will be mandatory for independent media outlets to join. What's your responsibility until the bill comes into force? Introducing a new bill takes time. Therefore, until the Loyalist News and Media Association is properly set up and the bill has come into force, the Loyalist government has created temporary guidelines for you to follow. Do not print deceitful content that may harm the appearance of our country. Do not print deceitful content that may harm the appearance of the Loyalist government. Do not print deceitful content that may harm the appearance of the president. And do not print deceitful content that may glorify the acts of rebels or other criminals. Do print content that strengthens loyalty towards the government. Do print content that inspires morality in the public. And finally, do print content that harkens propriety in our society. The Loyalist government expects your cooperation in this matter and hopes you understand the consequences of disobedience and or affiliation with disloyal members of the public. How do I remove the improper content from my paper? First, drag an article to your desk. Second, read through the article and look for fallacies. Third, cut over paragraphs that do not fit with the government guidelines. Fourth, Give your article to journalists so that they can transcribe it. Make sure that you only give them an article you have fully edited, as mistakes can be quite devastating. That is all for this instructional tip. Remember that the guidelines presented during this film are for media outlets in Westport only, and is not to be shared with the public.
Hold on, guys. It seems the stream is not working so great. Uh, hold on. Let me see if I can fix it up. Are you able to see it well? Is it running? This is the mail I got. Frank doesn't like uh, that Phil is very loyalist. So here's some more mail. You drag it over here. Let me see. I think that is acting up. Can you guys uh, see it well or is it choppy? Okay, so these are my employees for the paper. And as you can see, Anne is married. She lives by the Eastern factories, has a, has a child, uh, and went to community college. She is sort of She's loyalist, but looks, um, yeah, she's much more loyalist than Rebel. And then Phil is uh, a loyalist supporter, lives in the Western Districts, lives with disabled brother, and went to private college. Frank lives alone, no college education, lives by the Eastern factories, and he's opposed to the loyalists before they before they even came to power. Um, Anne... Wait, didn't I just... Oh, I did Anne, okay. Julie is known for having doubtful opinions of the government. She went to community college and worked aboard a, a freelance writer. Okay, uh, so the idea is to look through these articles. So the tutorial about censorship shows you what you can do. So you could change the headline there's usually only two choices and then you can censor some of the pinpoints if you want so let's give this to um who should we give this to it's a tutorial so it's not gonna make that much of a difference. And these are our employees. So they might not always agree to or want to to publish something that you give them. But you can see it could censor stuff. Let's give this to Phil. And now we have two actual articles. So loyalist government pursues harsher actions against suspected rebels. Do that, or you could be more harsh and against the government and say loyalist government attacks the privacy of civilians. So if anyone wants to give me an opinion uh, in the chat, I can answer. I can go by your uh, suggestions, or I could just choose what I want to do. Um, I'm gonna try to see if I can finish the game. If no one gives me any advice, I'm gonna try to see if I can finish the game while being a little rebellious. So. Let's try. Oh, he doesn't wanna do it. Let's see. If Julie will. Julie's willing to do it. So the public culture bill is passed. And that's uh, going to be... In, uh, it's going to go into effect in 12 weeks. Let's try this. Alright, so that worked. Now let's send it to print.
Neither are my employees chatting now. I think this is pretty much the same, the first one, no matter what you choose. Guys, let me see the... Is the stream working? It keeps getting choppy. Okay. Uh, so these are our sales from the first week. Or week zero. Um, so we were not as popular in the north. As you can see. So each... Um, area has their own preference of articles. Okay, so we are considered a little more rebellious now. Also, the loyalists are suspicious. and But we earned 18 popularity. Nice. Okay, we've got mail. Got a little letter from the government. All right, let's see what options we have. So far, the two games I've played, I did get different options. So I think the I'm not sure if they change based on your choices the previous week or if they are random. But let's see what we have. Um, I don't think I've seen this one. Text we lowered thanks to government effort. Uh, I like that title. <laughs> so let's try this again. Right now, my goal is to try to finish the game with a little rebellious streak without pissing off the government. So I may have to tone it back a bit. Um, I'm not gonna show you all of the articles because I want you to be able to discover something on your own when you're playing. Feel free to chime in in the chat if you want to tell me uh, a choice to make. Yeah, I'm probably gonna really, I'm probably gonna get closed down again. Loyalist attempt to indoctrinate the nation's youth. I'm not sure how much the censorship actually affects the game. It seems, um, I, f I feel like there could have been better options for the censorship part. The titles usually are pretty different, the headlines, but the censorship, I'm like, I, I don't know how much of a difference I'm making when I censor something. Uh... You can only give one article to each employee, so there's always going to be some leftover articles that you can't use. Um, let's see, if you want to do some celebrity gossip. We do Starlet Flea's crumbling marriage into the arms of CoStar. Let's see what happens. Send it to print.
10 weeks left. Let's see how we did. Ugh, we lost a lot of popularity there. Minus three popularity. And plus four rebel, plus seven suspicion. Yeah, we got some mail from the government. Okay, so the Northern Herald was shut down and so was their, the agency that takes care of their marketing, their advertising. So now we have to control the advertising as well. Uh, let's this. That sounds a lot like the Republicans, doesn't it? Uh, okay. I haven't seen this one. New presidential statue planned for Central Westport. Let's see who that pisses off. Northern Harold shuts its doors. I like this one. New health study shows benefits of tobacco. The other option is new study shows smoking kills, but if you don't show this part, the headline's kind of true. Sort of? I don't know. No one's protesting that one. Um... Let's see... Alright, let's send that. Okay, so now we have to choose the layout. I think we should promote tobacco usage for fun. Uh, yeah, that's gonna go over well with the government. And last one, the factory workers. Okay, let's go to marketing. So we didn't, we're not doing too well in the north, so I'm gonna try to boost our advertising there. South seems to like us better, so let's try that. See if I can make it through the whole game. Okay, so we got a little more favorable in the north, but the west we're suffering. Uh, 10 plus rebel, uh, plus 19 suspicion, and but we got 17% popularity, but they're not happy with us. I might have to tone it down a bit. Oh no. So we're gonna have to give Frank something a little less uh, antagonistic. Let's see. Pirate radio station gets shut down. Is a little is in trouble, so let's give him something gossipy. See, 
see here, I don't see how censoring anything really changes it. Um, I feel like the censoring aspect could have been a little more interesting. So far, it only seems to have an effect on some of them, but most it's like, eh, it doesn't really matter, I could leave it the same. Uh, unless I'm missing something. Minor measles outbreak. Or epidemic in elementary schools caused by poor funding. Let's go with that. We can go with... See, there it's interesting, because um, if you censor it, we could make it more... make it sound a lot worse than it is. Like, if we censor those two... But I don't know really how that actually affects... Oh! Okay, it affects that. They don't want to take it. Let's see if Julie will take it. Julie will take it. Julie doesn't have a problem spreading fear. Um, let's see. Fast food chain, new apartments, uh, Westport police shut down smuggling ring. I need to tone down the rebellious stuff for a bit. See, I don't see how this changes much, but let's try that. Um, let's spread that fear. Movie star. West was suffering last time. So you can see here which uh, which kinds of news they like. The Westport Independent um, in the northern suburbs is not gonna hit uh, their most popular, which is societal. I mean, it, their most popular is celebrity and industrial, and here we have mostly societal. So it's going to go best in the south and east. So let's see. One more there. Alright, let's try that. Yeah, we did. Eh, not that, not that great. Plus, the, oh boy, um, I'm gonna end up getting us shut down. I lost popularity too. I better work on that. Got a lot of letters. Okay, so the rebellion, the rebellion is starting to send us a lot of letters. Okay, so the, birth the president has a birthday celebration coming up, and uh-oh, now Julie's in trouble. Alright, so we better give Julie something a little less... Uh... Yikes, he wants to force propaganda onto the press. Should we try that? So here's another point where the censorship actually matters, but I don't think it always does. Um, let's force her. Why not? Mm. 
So, preparations for the president's birthday. Let's give them a little bone, so maybe this will take the heat off us a little bit. Especially since Julie's in trouble. people arrested for protesting. Let's try that. Uh, he doesn't want it, so let me give it... Give it to Frank, even though he's already in trouble. Movie star gets... Wax figure and exhibition honoring local celebrities. Let's try this. Alright, proceed to layout. Let's give... Put this on the front. We're, so, we're in so much trouble, aren't we? Harold and Finn. And... that. Oh, whoops, I didn't spend all my money there. Feel free to chime in if you want to help me make decisions. so great in the north. Oh no, we lost popularity. We got mail. More rebel stuff. Alright, see what our options are. Um, Rebels hijack radio show. Try this. say government adds untested substances to drinking water if you want to cause fear. Let's do that. Just for fun. Um, and revival outsources to underdeveloped country. So I think the first game that I got closed down, it was like on week seven or eight. So, I might still get closed down. Ah. 
Looks like we made 19 popularity, now, but we're getting the loyalists very suspicious. Oh no! Okay, I might have to tone it down a bit if I want to survive past like 7th or 8th week. Um, let's try this. So, could either piss them off or appease them. Let's try appeasing them for a little bit. of respectability and social sensibility. File erotica. I like this one. The biggest criticism is of a bathing scene which suggests nudity. And one more. Multiple industrial giants expected, suspected of having connections to violent gangs. Plus two loyalists. Okay, so they're a little happier with us. Negative 18 of our the suspicion. That really helped. But we lost four popularity. I think the rebels are annoyed. Oh no! Ha! Ah, I haven't seen that before. Let's see, what's the other one? Okay, so what are our options now? I wonder if we can get sued by Remival Industries. Um, new park plan, that's nice. Or not. that kind of stuff. Um, construction company accused of hiring illegal immigrants. Or... <laughs> Let's try... And police prevent attempted bombing. Well, let's see if Remival Industries can sue us. And 
one more bombs destruct route. Let's try some actual news. Force and to do it. Alright. I think I, I might not make it. They might close us down. Oh, someone asked uh, what game this is. It's the Westport Independent. It's a newspaper censorship game that's coming out in a few days. likes us now. A lot. Uh oh. That was bad. <laughs> Alright. I better tone it down again because they're getting very suspicious. Um, we can do government to censor and ban improper movies or a new bill to make sure cinemas show proper material. Let's do this one to show them we're not so bad. Crazed gunman murders family of four. This might appease them, but piss off the... Come on, eh. No one wants to do this. Phil? Alright, Phil's willing to. President visits schools. That seems like a very fl big fluff piece. Especially if we just do it this way. Oh, and Julie's willing to write about that. Um. Government funded study claims that medical care has greatly improved or greatly improved medical care in state hospitals thanks to new regulations. Um, let's take that out just to appease them. I just don't want to get closed down before the game ends. Uh, That's, that's big news that the president visited schools, right? And marketing. Still need some in the north. The east was pretty good. But let's keep it. Alright, let's see how it goes. Let me know in the chat if you're having trouble with the stream, if it's choppy or anything. Alright, we made it to week... Not so great, as far as sales go. I'm plus 7 loyalist and negative 20 suspicion, but lost a lot of popularity, that's not good. Okay, let's see. Hey! Oh no, I guess I wasn't loyal enough. They took Frank. I'm down to three employees, so I can only publish three articles this week. Um, 
president struck by tomato. influence Westport paper. Police scare populace with conspiracy theories. And one more. New loyalty reviews for government employees. Totally sh gonna shut me down, aren't they? Let's try an even split for a change. See what happens. We almost made it. What? Whoa! <laughs> Selling well now. Wow. No, no mail today. All right. Let's see. Maybe we could be a little rebellious. New committee to monitor devious content in comic books. Government censors comic books. Post that. Uh, new law to improve national security. New government initiative to use hearsay as evidence. to work uh let's give them a little less Almost there. Somehow it didn't get closed down yet. Oh shit! <laughs> the North did not sell at all. Okay, that was not such a great week. Uh oh. Lost a lot of popularity there. Oh no, they took Julie also! Down to two employees. Uh oh. And <laughs> unemployment rises. Let's try this. Alright, fine, Phil. Don't do anything useful. Sorry. 
I think it's the last week, so maybe we could be a little rebellious. Uh, students protest against police brutality. Last week, let's see what happens. All right, we got a lot of popular, a lot of sales in the east and south. Not so much in the west, and nothing in the north. Uh, <laughs> let's see what happened. Oh, we reached the end. So now the game is going to basically tell us what happened in each of the areas, the north, east, west, and south, and then talk about each of the characters. Achievements, um, if you gain a certain amount of loyalty, uh, of approval from the loyalists versus the rebels, and vice versa. Ah, there we go. Wow, I didn't realize we were so supportive of the government. Basically, a description, each game, assuming you make it to the end, you'll get this for each area. I was actually kind of hoping the game would be a little more humorous and absurd. Uh, it's slightly bland? I don't even know if it's slightly bland. Uh, the... The headlines, I think uh, I'm finding them the most entertaining. This ending thing is a little bit uh, wordy. I kind of wanted more out of it when you make it to the end. this on the dead bodies pretty morbid it 
also seems sometimes... I have to... I might have to play again to confirm it, but... Uh, I've tried keeping... I've tried keeping the paper from getting any... From upsetting the Loyalist Party at all. And... I still ended up getting some letters about my... Uh, my employees writing... Uh, rebellious articles even though I don't remember giving them anything rebellious so I'm not sure if that's uh, something I just didn't realize or you know I didn't realize it was rebellious or just the fault of the game where it's uh, it's not really you know it's um, too linear so even if you don't rebel it still acts like you do Personally, I was just hoping for a little more humor. It's still an interesting game, though. Um, I may play through it one or one more time before writing my review to get a better handle on it. game. So if you want to see other endings and other newspaper clippings that you can and headlines you can use, uh, check out the game. I think it's out this Thursday, uh, and I'll have a review out sometime around then. But uh, that's about one playthrough. It's about an hour, and then there's multiple endings to try for. So, hope you enjoyed this, and if you did, please subscribe to my channel. Thanks. Bye bye.